nowadays our uh, uh, national security advisors uh, they have regular dialogue right and the main issue that they discuss today is our economic cooperation so it's another evidence how economic issues are closely interrelated with security issues if we have you know well developed economies if you know our economic cooperation is at the high level it means that security issues will be you know uh, improved as well when our people have uh, you know jobs have uh, a high level of uh, employment rate so it means that our people have less stimulus to be you know radicalized and to uh, choose another way of life i would say and in this term I believe when it comes to Afghanistan, it's a kind of uh, our collective regional responsibility. If we want to make our region prosperous, if we want to make our region successful, uh, compatible, uh, competitive, sorry, on international markets, we should develop our regional cooperation. And without Afghanistan, to develop cooperation between Kazakhstan, in general Central Asia and Pakistan, it would be, I believe, extremely difficult. And Pakistan can serve, again, as a transit hub in terms of developing our trade. And I believe that probably Afghanistan could be uh, as, you know, uh, most beneficial part in this term. So that's why I believe that we should establish a dialogue with the Taliban, for example, our special envoy special envoy of the president of Kazakhstan on international affairs, His Excellency Mr. Yezhan Kazakhan. He visited Kabul recently. He had talks with the Taliban, he had talks with the new government of uh, Afghanistan. The main idea is to establish a dialogue. It's very important. Without a dialogue, it would be extremely difficult to convince our Afghan brothers that it's time to reconsider approach and it's time to develop cooperation in our region.